Okay. How are you doing, Yog? Okay, so we saved last night. Um, and we were heading there. Uh, Yogso was um, kind enough to remind me to save. Uh, to do a quick save facing the right door. <laughs> okay. So that looks a bit like this. Let me just... Uh, I keep pressing Q to open the quest log, but that's not going to do it, is it? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Uh, Volca cards. Sure. Why not? Let's do that. You asked for this. You asked for this. Come on, get him. He has a shield on. Makes it a bit more difficult. Okay. Cart, where? Where the fudge were you? Anyway. Okay, that's not too bad. Uh, energy shield. Energy shield. Cart was getting a smoothie back there. Nice going, buddy. Uh, sometimes I've ended up a semester, things are behind me. I feel like I had less things to worry about. Yeah, you know what? Um, I remember being a, a student. I'd gladly go back to being a student. <laughs> okay. Okay, we're in the Volker base. Inside the Volker base. You're inside the Volker base, but you still have to locate the prototype accelerator. It's probably probably stored somewhere off the main level. Under heavy guard. Fun! Under heavy guard, you say. Okay. Anything in here? These look like... I really want to use them like levers in Tomb Raider, but they're not, are they? <laughs> mm. Yeah, yeah, cutie, yeah, I, that's, that's a fair point. Okay, standard door. Ooh. Ooh. Walker Patrol Droid. Shame it's a droid that wants to... To damage us. Now that must have. Been uh, that was a bit premature, don't you think? Mm, well, that wasn't great. Sweet pea, welcome in, sweet pea. How are you doing? Yeah, that did hurt. Thank you. Whoop. Oh, come on. Could you try hitting him? You miss every time. Whoa. I hear an interesting beat. Okay, no remains. Anything to plunder? No. How many enemies? Two of them? Oh, one more over there perhaps. You know what? Let's do that first. My overconfidence is my weakness. Your faith in your friends is yours. 
Nope, don't go for the door. Can you please not go for the door? Thank you. Good. Very good. Even better. Hey, that works. Okay, nope, good. Great. Well, ish. <sighs> yeah, where's the magic claw? Or where's the fire sword? Fire sword! Remains. My ring light is fluctuating. I keep losing ring lights. What is going on? <laughs> It's still not dead though, who knows. Okay, that's a thing. Uh, could be the cats. Nah, not the cats, they're not in the room. Okay, so, uh... Flash the computer, two spikes... Uh, wait, let's log out for a second. Let's save. So if you murder all the black Volkers, why do we need to, to win the race? Well, I don't know. They're they seem to be angry about something. <laughs> uh, so let's see how this works. Hmm. It worked. Access security cameras. Oh, that's cool. A lovely user interface. So that's us. Okay. Oh, five spikes. How many do I have? Fourteen. Hmm. Do I want to waste five spikes to overload? Let's see what happens. Let's see how effective that would be. Yeah. Okay. Rec room, not too many. Cool. It's empty. Garage elevator. Turrets. Ooh, eight spikes. Okay, so I'm thinking we don't waste all these all the spikes we have at this point. Next class is about to start. Have a good class, Kitty. See you soon. Uh, and take our chances with the security droids. Anything else? Control room. A twilight. Okay. Let's log out. received good that's a lot of XP never tell me the odds okay I'm gonna have to stop doing that though uh, <laughs> echoing lines okay uh, what is that On it. Done. it's a thing hmm? hey that's an that sus looks suspiciously like the dome of a modern astromech. <laughs> One that's not supposed to exist at this point in time, but that's okay. Can 
crusher coin. Okay, so let's do this. Uh, I want to do a big save first. Yeah, uh, a couple of thousand years too early for this kind of astromech. <laughs> yeah, it's funny if you look at the at the history of. Oh, it's not canon anymore. That's legends, but. Um, the R1 units that you see in um, in the background in, Star in the original Star Wars are much clunkier, much bigger compared to the modern sleek R2 units. So that's totally off. <laughs> Whoa! That sounds like an Imperial droid. Again, a couple thousand years too early. <laughs> No, I checked this. Okay, anything else? You know what I've been trying to get going? Jedi Knight 2. But... No dice so far. Yeah, the R ones look... Um, the dome is huge and the tentacles beneath it. They do look a bit like a, a huge jellyfish. Punch it! Punch it, Z, punch it! There you go. That is not an enemy. Please Waitress. don't hurt me. I just serve the food here, that's all. I'm not like these others. I'm not even a black bulker. Please don't kill me. Why would... Okay... She is too dangerous to be left alive. Oh, I have to stop doing that. I'm sorry. Okay, how did you end up here in the Volker base? My name is Ada. My father <gasps> owed Davik some money, but he couldn't pay. Ada! Davik killed my father and sold me into slavery here at the Volker compound to pay off the debt. <laughs> Ada Wong. <laughs> yeah. That's the wrong Ada Wong. Uh... Don't worry, I just want to ask you a few questions. But I don't know anything. I'm just a prisoner here, a slave. The Volkers don't tell me anything. They treat me like dirt. They beat me up if I screw up their orders. You may know more than you think, miss. Help us and we'll help you, okay? Well, all right. I still don't know how much help I can be. But I sure hope you get rid of all the Volkers. I hate them. Okay. Uh, first of all, where can I find a prototype swoop engine accelerator? What are you doing, Cora? What? I I've never heard of such a thing. I guess it might be in the garage on the lower level. That's where all the Volkers go to work on their swoop bikes. But I've never been down there. The elevator is protected. Oh, because of the health, system. yeah. Only the Volkers are allowed to go down there. Wow, that's unsettling. She slouched. Okay. Uh, I'm looking for a prisoner, a woman named Bastila. Is she that Republic soldier? Yes. I heard one of the Volker mention her, but she's not here. He said Brezhik didn't trust his men around her. I guess she's too important to be a slave here in the kitchens. Getting pawed and groped and kicked and spit on like me. Brezhik must have taken her somewhere safe. Hmm. If I let you go, can you find your way out of here? Now that you've killed the guards who were supposed to watch me, I, I think I could find my way out of here. Hurry then, get out of here. I I'm free to go? You're not gonna kill me? Why would I kill I you? I don't know how I can ever repay you! What's Thank wrong you. with these people? Thank you! Uh, I have to get out of here before any of the Volkers see me! Go ahead. Uh. Okay, uh, let's do that. I'm not sure how wise that is, 
but okay right I just wanted to make sure we can't return to the high dike right now um, so let's how are we doing on med packs bear kit antidote kit packs 14 well let's use one That's gonna have to do it for now. Anything in here? Oh, good. I'm a fan of this cache. Whoa. That's intimidating, okay. That's the security panel over there. That's how we came in, okay. Those are bunks. That's the droid we killed. Okay. That's not gonna end well. Not great. Z is doing very poorly. Okay. Mm. Do uni students learn cooking? Yes, there is an actual university that does some of that. <laughs> no, not the university. Up. These days they're called professional high schools. That's the other door, right? Yeah, okay. Where am I? Oh, over here, okay. Guys? Okay, that's this bit. Right, I see, I see. Yeah, that kind of looks like the bar, sure. And that's this door over here. Yes, I think I checked that, but we can check again. Good. Okay, let me take a look at the map. So, uh, that's the armory. We did that that is the rec room yeah okay that over here is the sewers we that's where we came from that over here is the lower city okay uh control room over here uh, so we need to go over here right that's those are the areas we haven't been in hmm why don't i feel like being able to find my way around here Right, okay, that away. This way. That's over here, yes, okay. On it. Done. You're high, how are you doing? Star Wars is my favorite Babylon 5. <laughs> yeah, let's not get into that debate. <laughs> how are you, right? What a wama mulira, King Kuncho Peshak, Noba Muliraji, Johnny Yuturunchi, we eat a dia. I'm not like Brajak and his new vocals. Really? He surrenders. What are you talking about? You're a vocal, aren't you? Tonga Bugsham Uninong, 
I'm a vocal, but I was here long before Bridget took over. I was a vocal back when it meant something, back when we had honor. Then Bridget and her followers took over and turned our gang into a bunch of violent thugs and bloodthirsty punks. Now they treat us, uh, they treat all us original vocals like second class citizens. That makes no sense. Uh, take me for example, I used to be one of the highest ranking vocals in the gang. Now I'm stuck on guard duty here in the back, all oh, thanks to Brezhik. Damn it, Brezhik. If you hate Brezhik so much, why don't you leave the gang? Uh, I've been trying to work up to courage, uh, work up the courage to leave, but it's not easy. Brezhik followers will try to hunt down anyone who leaves the Volker gang. He says he won't let traitors live. Ha! Brezhik and his followers are the real traitors. They turned Gadon and uh, and now, oh, they turned on Gadon. Now they slaughter the Bekas in the streets and anyone else they happen to run across. Brezhik knows anyone with a character will never willingly follow a leader like him, so he uses brutality and violence to stay in power. Yeah, that. I like that, very typical. Um. Hmm. That's not what I'm gonna say. I don't wanna just let him go though. You better give me some information if you want to live. Sure, whatever you want to know. It's not like a old scum lord project anything. Okay. Uh, where can I find the prototype swoop engine accelerator? Right, that gadget project stole from the backs. He's the uh, he's got the accelerator in the basement garage. The only way down is by using the security elevator in the back of the base. But the security elevator is protected by auto-targeting laser cannons. You'll be vaporized with ooh, a pass card. Okay, where can I get a pass card? If I had one, I'd give it to you. But Brezhik only gave them to the lieutenants. You have to get a pass card from one of them, but I doubt they just uh, hand it over to you. Is there any way to disable the security cannons? Is it possible to slice? Yes, so we can... Mm. Can we ask him anything else? Prototype swoop, prisoner... Let's ask him about Bastila. She's got her stashed away somewhere safe, somewhere outside the base. Okay. Yeah, I think that's all the information we're gonna get out of him. I'm going to let you live. Go on, get out of here. On your way, my dude. Oh, you can do it. Inside the Volker base. The project accelerator is stored in the basement, but the only way down is through the security elevator in the back of the Volker base. You need a pass card to use the elevator unless you can disable the security cannons protecting it. Yeah, didn't we blast most of these guys? I think. Good. Ooh, are we gonna get hurt if we touch this? Probably not. Uh, Z, can you please? Uh, okay. <laughs> hmm? Bunks? Yes, that's this place. Remains. Yeah, he's hurting bad. Ooh, ooh. Okay, you can hit him from over here, right? Thank you. Get items. 
credits. Republic credits. It's a good thing we're not dealing with any Tidarians. Have you tried equipping Big Z? Equipping what? Let's heal him a bit. Oh, maybe we can... Oh, wait. Yeah. Weapons, armor. Sure. <laughs> Do. Okay, so... Uh, Bowcaster? <laughs> yeah, maybe. Okay, uh, we do have some... Uh, heavy combat suit? Right. Oh, we can't... Yeah... Longsword, blaster pistol, bum, 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 bum. to hit plus four. Let's see. Strength dexterity. Computer use. Repair security. Treat injury. Mm -hmm. Well, let's give him. Over here, dude. Okay. Um, yeah, let's give him the heavy blaster. Okay. Cardio regulator. Really? Let me take another look. Missions Vibro Blade. Oh, that's her Vibro Blade. Anything else? Prototype Vibro Blade. Blaster Pistol, Ion Blaster. Yeah. Other than him being missions, you know, guard essentially, bodyguard. Is that what you mean? Because Wookiees can use anything. I don't have a bowcaster. I would gladly equip a bowcaster for him. But let's give him this. Probably. I'm not sure. Uh, let me do what? this though. Um, we do have one cardio regulator, stealth fuel generator. Do we want to use? Oh right, we have a stealth fuel generator. Why not use it from time to time? Okay, let's uh, equip this guy. Yeah, probably that's what happened. Um, yeah, let's keep it equipped. Okay. Hmm? Anything else? Okay, some spikes. Anything else in these bunks? No. We can't rest until daytime. Mm-hmm. 
And that's this, yes, okay. These corridors sure do wind. A uh, pool droid. Hey, a pool droid. Uh, leave the droid alone for now. I don't think I wanna. Maybe we'll have to repair the pool or something. Who knows? Or fill the pool. Nope, not there. Uh, can I actually go down there? Oh yeah, it's doesn't look too steep. Hey! Whoa! 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 Guys! Ah! Fudge! I'm gonna have to load. Yeah, what do you know? It hurt us. Okay, this is before I... <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> uh, let me do that again. Oh yeah, I did equip him. Okay. Okay. Yes, okay. Maybe the pool droid was useful, yes. No, not here. Over here. Okay. Um. What? Program droid to crone to pull and self destruct? Leave it alone? Items lost, yes. I don't want to destroy the droid, but we don't have other options for him. And four repair parts up to 17. Do we... why would we need this? Maybe that stash there and down there is really useful or something? But what would happen if... Any... any... Karth, you... You're not very smart, Karth. <laughs> okay. Uh. Okay, let's see what happens and how it happens. Can't take you anywhere, Karth. Okay, so what? Oh, oh, okay, I see. Yeah. Dual steel bonding alloy, hair trigger, uh, cardio regulator. Okay. Uh -huh. Cars, let's equip you with the cardio regulator as well, my dude. What? You know, I'm getting the feeling he's gonna be that way all the time. Okay, so... Uh, we've explored this bit, apparently. Let's move back. Yeah, so let's go back here. I'm still so confused about the map, but that's okay. I just look at it more. Yes, over here is where we haven't explored. Security panel. Search pass card. But we don't have... Oh, did we get one? Oh, we looted someone. Oh, I didn't even see that. Huzzah!
You've successfully shut down the thermal security systems protecting the elevator to the garage level of the Volker base. Now all we have to do is go down there and find a prototype accelerator and deal with an angry Volker. I apologize, any angry Volker. Volkers you might uh, meet along the way. Uh, sure, great, I like that. I like the sound of that. Um, Yeah, okay. Defense turret. Can we do anything with the turrets? Are they gonna smack us in, on the head? No, they're just offline. Okay. Ooh, fancy. Junk bio droid, cool, cool. Fighters, uh, patrol droid. Get into range and hit him. Okay, they got him. Matt, welcome and how are you doing? Door is locked. Anything to loot? No. Okay. Whoa, whoa. Uh, garage head. Whoa. Funny, he looks like a whole body. <laughs> so bad. Oh. Hey, move! I know, I know. That escalated quickly. Uh, too quickly. Okay, let's approach this slightly differently. Boy, it's a good thing we have safe quick saves, right? Um, you, droid. What are our options right now? Optimize droid weaponry, optimize droid targeting system, activate droid shields, engage droid in patrol mode. If we engage him in patrol mode, he's gonna shoot at everyone who's our enemy, right? Huh. Let's test that out. Thank you for the lurk, Rob. Any enemies and encounters, okay. Leave it alone. Let's see if that helps us in any way. Uh, that doesn't look good. Uh, Big Z, careful. Ready. No. Is that him or a different Wookie? Hmm? Yeah, cards are tank, it seems. Okay. Here we go. 
If I want to save, I wasted those repairs on the droid and it didn't have the effect I wanted. No. Let's leave this one alone. Where's the other one? Hey! Oh. Wait, is that the one I activated? Surely not, but maybe yeah. <laughs> hmm. Just one? No, wait. Now that must have been. Ooh, nice. Good. That was lucky. Okay. Okay, hit him. Good. Oh, oh, mine. Okay. Uh, let's disable it. I don't think we can. Mine or gas mine? <laughs> See what you did there? Hit him! Oh. Oh, okay. Good. Uh, Z leveled up. Skills. Remaining points three. Okay, computer use. No. Demolitions. What do you recommend, game? Really? Uh, why does the game keep recommending that I bump Big Z's computer skills? Treat injury. Point cost one. Let's increase that by one, yeah. Point costs one. Aren't Pookie's good with computers? I don't know. I'm not sure he's good with computers because. He's from the ICT. <laughs> no. Hmm. Okay, sure, why not? That's probably a bad idea, but who knows? Hmm? Hmm. No, not this one. Oh, sure. Actually, why not? You asked for this. <laughs> Credits. Okay. Special pass to open that door, yes, okay. Okay, so 
both of these doors. What's over here? Sheesh. He's effective, efficient with that fibro blade. Ready. Yes. I'm here. Radiation shield. door. Ooh. Okay. Credits. And repair kit iron grenade. Good, good. Anything else in here? No, that looks like the edge. Alright. Nothing beyond this bit, yes. You really have to be close to the walls for the map to register you being around the edges that's something I've noticed so we definitely can't get past without the special card there I guess uh, uh, was there a corridor around here? no, no corridor, just a thingy okay but these look like special engines alright uh, those, that's probably not the special suit prototype though. Let's go back there. In the main thing. Yeah, okay. You guys coming? Thank you. Been in this room, figures. Ooh. Now that must have been oh, a door shot. Must have hurt. See how that turns out. Oh, sorry, guys. I'm just so zoned out and zoned in at the same time. Uh, there's a door over here and the corridor up there. At least to the same bit, standard door. Okay. Russian desk. Oh, key card. Improved energy cell. Pazak! Hey, cute! As Babu Freak likes to say. Hey! That's all he says. <laughs> mm. Med packs. Cool! Garage computer. Slice the computer, two spikes. And do we wanna? Let me log out for a second and see what we get. And if we get something special, sure. Security camera cameras. Okay, that's the same kind of thing. Crouch office, that's us. 
Okay. That's that looks like the prototype. Yeah, engine lab. Well, it makes sense. It makes sense that it's in the engine lab, right? Mm, loading bay, a droid. Okay. Mm. System commands. Open all security doors. Three spikes. Mm. Here is schematics. Return to main. Well. I guess we could open all the doors, but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna load this. Yes, I know. Uh, I'm I'm sure people do this sometimes when they play this. I, I imagine they do. I'm gonna load this, and if I absolutely need to use the unlock all security doors option, I'm gonna go back and do it. Stop! Don't open that door. Remains. Bye bye. Right, so does that mean we can just return now and... I really want to get all the edges. Come on, game! Don't do that, please. Thank you. So that I'm sure that I've been here and everything's clear. Yes, okay. Anything else I didn't know? Doesn't look like it. Alright. Let's try and get back. It was over here, right? Down this corridor. Yeah. Over here, security doors, I think. Yeah. We have visitors, Lucky's coned by, no, conned by Garen Thack, and he's trying to steal Project Swoop Engine Accelerator, I bet. Well, you're talking like Brezhik didn't steal that engine himself to begin with. I didn't go through the trouble of acquiring this prototype just so you could steal it back <laughs> for that old fool. Would you like me to dispose of these back spice? Oh, Candon? No. Uh, hold on a second. I see you aren't wearing the hidden back color, so I'm guessing you aren't part of that feeble old man's gang. You must be a freelance mercenary. Yeah, they use the same motto for this guy as well. You know what? Mm, I'm te technically he's right. I'm not a hidden back. I am a, a mercenary. That doesn't mean we're gonna be nice to him. I'm gonna say my name is Cora Jade. You're right. I'm not one of the backs. Technically speaking, let's see how this develops. Why don't you come work for us? The Black Volkers could use someone like you. Oh. I don't know about that. Uh, Decisions. Let's see if we can still refuse him after we ask him about the offer. What's your offer? You need someone to get rid of Gatton permanently. If you do this uh, task for him, Brezhik is willing to offer a very substantial reward. How does 500 credits sound? We'll throw in that young Republic soldier we can. Oh, fudge! What? Are they talking about Bastila? No. Oh. See, this is why I'm ha I have so much trouble with RPGs. You actually have to make decisions like this. <laughs> I thought she was offered up as the prize in the swoop race. 
We can't just give the girl to you, not after Brazil to publicly offer her up as a price. Oh! But we can do the next best thing. Which is what? Uh, whoever wins this full prize gets the girl. Kill Gadon and we'll give you 500 credits. Sponsor you as a vocal writer and equip your swoop with the accelerator. You can't lose. That doesn't sound fun though. So I can accept at this point. Forget it. I don't want to switch sides. I'm not sure this is good, but I don't want to switch sides. I, do, I don't feel like switching sides. I'm too old and jaded now and I don't do that thing when I when I'm young and impulsive and I switch sides. I know Cora doesn't look like she's old and jaded, but we're old and jaded at heart. Uh, we've gone past the moment where Han is mature enough to, to recognize that he should be working with the resistance, the rebellion, I mean. Um, okay, how do we approach this? Okay, let's be melodramatic. Forget it. I'm not going to betray Gavin. Fun talking to you. Most unfortunate. Okay, we're gonna die, probably. Kill them, kill them. Okay. Uh, game, don't don't spaz out, please. Okay, so there's. <sighs> Let's try this. Let's try. Get out of here, get out of here. Let's see if that works. Let's do that. Let's go back and engage. Okay. No. Okay, almost. Now that's Good. That didn't go well, but at least we won. Okay, there's a grenade over there. Thank you, Sikis. Uh, welcome back. Let's disable the mine. Swoop accelerator. Items received. Okay, let's check out the journal entry. Uh, Candon Lark, one of the black vocals, has given you uh, a counter to get on the yes, yes, yes. Okay. Uh, you will have two choices. Yep, I think we're done with that bit. With the two choices. I think we chose. We chose the noble way. Uh, who knows? Advanced med pack? No, not advanced. Just med pack. Uh huh. Med pack. Thank you. What? Just so you guys aren't running on empty. You know what? I can't see very well. Maybe I should put my glasses on. There. That works better. Okay. Uh, anything else to loot over here? 
now that we have the swoop accelerator no that's it looks like oh all right disruptor pistol yeah I think we've covered the garage or that area at least um, yeah okay so back here I think Sikis! Wow! <laughs> Thanks so much, Sikis! Thank you for gifting a sub to Texpex! Sikis! Thank you! Yep! <laughs> yeah, you gotta you gotta give up, Dexpex. <sighs> okay. Sikish is cool. Right. Um. Let's recap. which okay um, yeah let's get out of here so I think at this point we yeah we can't fast travel here We find our way back, right? There's the club again. Am I heading over here to the lower city? Do I need to pass by the lower city? Yes. I can go in the Undercity again if I like, because I do have the papers to- wait! Oh, that's the Volker base, yes, okay. So... I want to go back and do what? Um, give the swoop engine to... We do have the swoop engine, right? I didn't- I know I picked it up, but... Troop accelerator, yes. Uh, where was that guy? Was it in the north part of town? No, not the apartments. Oh no, it was in the... Yeah, in the hideout. In the hidden back hideout, right? Yes. Uh... Volker base over here, the apartments, Undercity, hidden back base, yes, cantina and the hidden back lockout. Hidden back, hello, hidden back. Gavin? You have returned. You have the prototype swoop engine accelerator with you? I have the accelerator right here. I was beginning to wonder if you would make it. 
The race is tomorrow, and my mechanics need time to install the prototype into the swoop engine of our bike. Uh... Okay, let's not... Okay, I lived up to my end of the deal. Now you better come through. Don't worry. I'm a man of my word. I thought so. I promised you could ride in the swoop race under the hidden back banner, and I'm still going to let you do that. Huzzah. And I'm even going to go one better. I'm going to let you ride the swoop bike with the prototype accelerator installed on it. Whoa, really? Without it, you won't stand a chance. Gaden, you can't be serious. We need one of our best riders on that bike. We can't let some rookie take the prototype engine into the race. Hmm. Uh, I don't know. I really don't. I want to ride the bike, though. <laughs> I have to be honest with you. There's a reason I'm letting you take the prototype engine. The accelerator is in state. Oh. There's a good chance it could explode during the race. I can't ask one of my own riders to take the risk. They'll be running unmodified swoops in the race. I see. You'll be the only one using the prototype. If you can complete the track before the That's how it is, huh? Okay, okay. If you die, then one of my other riders could still come through for me. <laughs> okay, sounds like you've got all the base, all your bases covered. You don't get to be leader of a swoop gang if you don't know how to work all the angles. Uh, okay, then I guess I'm ready for the race. You can stay here tonight. The mechanics need time to install the accelerator on the engine, so you won't be able to practice your riding, but I've got good instincts. And you have the look of a racer about you. <laughs> Just try to relax, and in the morning you don't know we'll take me, do you? Track. You spend a restless night in the back base. In the morning, one of the backs takes you to the swoop racing pits, where he, uh, where only racers and mechanics are allowed to go. This feels like a, a Sierra Quest interlude. You spend the night there. Time passes. <laughs> Uh, so you're the one who's going to ride the swoop bike, eh? Don't worry, I've been working on the accelerator and stability won't be a problem, I hope. Uh, Gavin mentioned that you've never done this before. You want me to run over the basics of handling a swoop bike for you? Uh, sure. Tell me how it's done. It's pretty simple, really. First, try not to crash into anything. There's debris and obstacles scattered all over the course, so watch out. All swoops are equipped with dynamic deflector systems, so hitting an obstacle won't cause you to crash, but it will make you... It will shake you up a bit and slow you down. Uh, the track also has accelerator panels built into the surface. If you fly, if you fly over them, it will give you a swoop, uh, a boost of speed, so try to hit them with, when you see them. Are we playing Mario Kart over here? Uh, okay, let's start the race. I better explain the rules to you. Each rider goes out on the track alone. At the end of the day, whoever posted the fastest time is the winner. Okay, so we won't be racing against other swoops. Normally, a rider can run as many uh, heats as they want, but I don't know how long the prototype accelerator uh, on your swoop will hold up. N um, no more than four or five races, I guess. So, five will be pushing it. So make your runs count. Garen's put his trust in you. We need to win the race or Bridget Focus will get a whole bunch of new recruits. If that happens, we're finished. I won't let you down. Sounds like you're ready. Go talk to the race announcer over by the counter. He'll give you time to beat and... Uh, oh, the time to beat and get you out on the course. I'll be waiting for you here after the run so I can make any tweaks or repairs to your swoop in case you want to go out for another heat. Good luck and don't worry about the prototype overheating and exploding while you're out on the track. The project that probably won't happen. Oh, I'm so, so reassured. We've leveled up. Six points, yes, we saved one. Okay. Computer use, two point costs. We have some someone in the party with better computer use at this point. Demolitions, stealth. Mm, I don't know how much we're gonna be playing or what. Okay, let's do two persuade. 
treat injury five. The next one will be Oh, that's point cost two, and we only have what? Okay, guess we can't. Um, and GV, yo, welcome in. Hey everyone, it's GV. <laughs> Better not soup this up. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna do... Can we get a shout out for GV, please? You guys, you probably know GV, but if you don't, do yourselves a favor. Go check out GV's stream. Um, repair. Sure, two point costs. Security, one point costs. Yeah, let's do repair. Let's accept. Sneak attack, okay. Thank you, GV. Yeah, uh, this is <sighs> so much to do in here, so. I imagine you'll enjoy this when you do get to playing it. What the heck, yeah, what is up with Streamlabs? There we go. What? I'm sorry, the, the bot is totally asleep again. Okay, so... Mm. We have to learn how to swoop race, right? Can we just mount one of the bikes? Race announcer? <laughs> That's unlikely, right? Poker card. Yeah, let's save after we've done this. Never understood why so many of you new riders make your first competitive start in the biggest race of the year. The accelerator again and slapped on your swoop will help, but I don't think that would be enough. Plus, there's always the chance it will explode during your run. Yeah, sure. Okay. Frick. Watch yourself out on the track rocky. Every year we lose a couple of your... Of you first time. <laughs> okay, I, I get the picture. Okay. Yeah, that's the same model. Okay, uh, wait, how do I. Mechanic? Oh, to the race announcer. Okay, okay. Uh, I'm not scared. Yes, okay. Let's talk to the race announcer. Why do you have to go there? Okay, uh, let's see how your sponsor, who your sponsor is. Uh, you're writing for the Hidden Becks? Always like them, I hope they can show the, these workers a thing or two, but I digress. Okay, you're registered now, good luck. And try not to get yourself killed. We've only lost one rider today and we want to keep it that way. Whenever you're ready, you can hit the track. Oh man, this is... <laughs> this is so cool. Okay, um... What happened to the rider you lost? Same as usual, he was pushing himself beyond his limits and he hit some debris on the track. The reflectors kept him from crashing, but the force of the impact jarred him from his suit. Well, that's gonna do it. Don't worry, uh, they scrapped what was left of him. Oh, scraped. Ooh, that's even worse. Okay, uh, what's the time to beat? Redros has the best time so far. 38 seconds, 43. Okay, I want to race one of my heats. Let's get you on the track. I have no idea how this is gonna work. What the F? Left click mouse to accelerate and shift gears. Use movement keys to avoid obstacles and hit accelerator pads. Now this is pod racing.
I have no idea what is going on. Oh, it's one of those. I'll be right with you. Thank you for playing Rob's Alert. Let me just finish one of these. Ooh. No, no. Holy poop. Ooh. You got the top time, you just beat racers who have been doing this for 20 years. This is amazing. Someone who's never in this room before. Today comes in here and wait a minute, I don't believe this. Look at the board. One of the vocals just beat your time. Who? It was Radros. Okay, okay, okay. Right, I see, I see. So we're gonna have to do this a bunch of times. Math, thank you so much for Rob's alert. Wait a second, let me... sure we don't forget the underscores thank you math okay so this is not too bad should we save now yeah let's let's make a quick save thank you for the hydrate sickies Okay, so we can talk to him again if we want to. Do we need to talk to the mechanic if we want to repair something? Uh, no, apparently not. Okay, so we didn't break it too much, I think. We just bumped into a couple of things. Let's raise another heat. Um, What's the time to beat? 33 is the time to beat. Okay. I want to race. <laughs> I guess Gary knew what he was doing when he picked you to write for us. Now the only thing is to wait for the time to become official and go collect the prize. Ladies and gentlemen, I present you the winner of this race. Well, really? Thank you. Bridget, leader of the Black Walkers. People, hear me! Before I present the so-called champion of the Bex with their prize, there is something you must know. The winning rider cheated. Of course. You're a damn liar, Brzezik. Your swoop bike was using a prototype accelerator. Clearly an unfair advantage. Because of this hidden Beck treachery, I'm withdrawing the Vulcan's share of the victory prize. But of course he is. You can't do this, Brzezik. You know the rules. Nobody's allowed to withdraw a victory prize after the race. It goes against all our sacred traditions. You old fool. Your traditions are nothing to me. I am the wave of the future. If I want to withdraw the prize and sell this woman on the slave market myself, nobody can stop me. I you want to bet? Something to say about that, Brzezik. Bastila. Yeah. <laughs> what? Impossible. 
You were restrained by a neural disruptor. <laughs> You've possibly summoned the will to free yourself. You underestimate the strength of a Jedi's mind, Brezik. A mistake you won't live to regret. Focus to me! Kill this woman! Kill the swoop rider! Kill them all! Okay, this is gonna go bad. So, uh, how many? Two Volker guards, and of course, Brezik. So we have Bastila on our side. Another Volker. Whoa, 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 whoa. No, okay, alright, so these guys first. Uh, maybe not? Let's disengage that one. There. I want to help, but I'm not very I'm not a very good shot, as you can see. I am helping a bit. Okay, Bastila is cool. Right. Uh, despite all odds, you managed to win the swoop race. However, Brigitte refused to give Bastila. Yes, somehow you're not surprised. <laughs> yes, somehow I'm not surprised. Well, maybe those bloody Vulcans will think twice next time before trying to keep a Jedi prisoner. And as for you, if you think you can collect me as a prize, wait. I don't believe this. Sure. You're one of the soldiers with the Republic fleet, aren't you? Yes, I'm sure of she it. She recognized How us. How did you end up racing for these swoop gangs? My name's Cora Jade. I'm here to save you. Save me? <laughs> is that what you were trying to accomplish by riding in that swoop race? Well, as far as rescues go, this is a pretty poor example. In case you hadn't noticed, I managed to free myself from that narrow Yes, I didn't notice that. It occurred to me the moment I said it. To say that I saved you. Brezik and his Volkers would have left you for dead if I hadn't stepped into that fight. You're lucky I was here to get you out of this mess. Karth is waiting for us. Karth and Nasi is alive? Yes. Finally, some good news. Karth is one of the Republic's best soldiers. He's proved himself a hero a dozen times over. And he sent you here to save me. Maybe I misjudged you. Karth wouldn't have sent you if he wasn't confident in your abilities. Forgive me. Despite my Jedi training, I still tend to act a bit rashly sometimes. Please, take me to Karth right away. Between the three of us, I'm sure we can figure out some way to get off this planet before the Sith realize we're here. Yay, progress. Is that a flashback? I'm sorry about the size though. They're playing in their native resolution. I'm sorry. I have to resize them on the fl on the fly. Whoa. Whoa. You cannot win. <gasps> Rivan. Yeah, that's him. I recognize the helmet. Bastila, you're alive! Finally things are looking up. Now I just need to figure out a way to get off this planet. You mean you don't have a plan to get off Taurus yet? What have you been doing all this time? Um... We've been trying to find you, remember? I see. Now that I'm back in charge of this mission, perhaps we can start doing things properly. Ooh. Hopefully our escape from Terrace will go more smoothly than when you rescued me from Brezik. I know you're new at this, Bastila, but a leader doesn't berate her troops just because things aren't going as planned. Don't let your ego get in the way of the real issues here. That hardly strikes me as an appropriate way of addressing your commander, Karth. I am a member of the Jedi Order, and this is my mission. She's a Jedi, all right. My battle meditation ability has helped the Republic many times in this war. And it will serve us well here, I'm sure. Your talents might win us a few battles, but that doesn't make you a good leader. A good leader would at least listen to the advice of those who have seen more combat than she ever will. Hmm. 
Okay, I'm gonna try and calm them down. Oh, so I can take sides. I don't want to take sides. I don't want to take cart side or Bastila's side. Both of you settle down. This isn't helping. Yes, you're right, of course. I apologize, Karth. This has been a difficult time for me. Of course, I'm happy to listen to your advice. What do you suggest we do? First off, we can't get hung up on who's in charge. We all need to work together if we want to get off this rock. Yeah, the answer that's how the is game works, we remember? Find it. Well said, Karth. And the sooner we start looking, the better. I've already been a prisoner of the Volkers, and I don't plan on being captured by the Sith. Hmm. Can we be a bit heroic, perhaps? Don't worry, I won't let that happen. I think we'll need some help getting off Terrace. Maybe if we ask around, one of the locals can help us out. We should probably start by asking around in the cantinas. Is something wrong? You seem as if something's troubling you. Uh, something weird happened um, when we first met, like a vision. Okay, so I can ignore that if I like, but I'm not gonna ignore it. A vision? A vision of what? A view fighting a dark Jedi, Rivan, I guess. Hmm. This is a bit strange. Such visions are often a sign of force sensitivity. Are you saying I can use the force? I'm not sure. It may be that you have some connection to the force. It would not be unheard of. When we first met, your natural talent may have fed off my own force abilities. It is possible that in the excitement of the battle's aftermath, the force allowed you to witness one of my more intense memories. Thank you, force. Huh. This isn't the first time I've had a vision. The force is complicated. Even I, with all my training, cannot fully understand it yet. This is a matter best left to the wise masters of the Jedi Council. Sure, okay. Once we escape Terrace, we can seek the guidance of the Council if you wish. They will understand the significance of your vision, if there is any. However, I think it would be best if we all stayed focused on the task at hand right now. We can't afford any distractions. We need to find a way off Terrace. Journal entry added. Okay. So. Uh, you experienced a powerful vision. The vision could be an indication that you have a strong connection with the Force, but Pastel was reluctant to speculate on such matters. Okay, we can leave it at that for now. Um, Bastila has been found, but you still have no way to escape Taris. Not only you need to depart uh, the departure codes to get past the Sith blockades around in Taris, you also need to find a ship. You're probably going to need help from one of the locals to get off the planet. Okay, so let me just check something out. Quests is L. Why is quests? Okay, log maybe. Who knows? Uh, who knows? How can I help? Then I suggest we move on. Okay, so we we're gonna check out the continuous. Yes, I know, I know. Then I suggest we move on. Femship and Caden together again. <laughs> I only I only know. I don't actually know what you're talking about, but I kind of know what you're talking about, because I haven't technically played. Oh, I'm hoping we don't get interrupted today. So far, so good, you know. Okay, so... Uh, mission is here. Hey there, what can I do for you? Uh, not now. Okay. Alright, do we have to include her in the party to... See what she's equipped. No, we don't. Right? Yes. Okay. Uh, she has uh, a blaster pistol. I don't see a bowcaster. Okay. Bastila. She has her clothes. Going through that, so. Right now, she isn't equipped with anything, right? Uh, Double bladed lightsaber? Okay, so we have a, 
a lightsaber which I assume only she can use. Um, that's you, okay. Um, yeah. Yeah, we can't use a double-bladed lightsaber. Uh, what are the prerequisites for using it? The item description over here. Quest items, yes. Um, proficiency lightsaber. Weapons proficiency. So it's a separate... Yes, I get it. Okay. Mm-hmm. Well... That doesn't really matter. Bastel is the Jedi, she's going to use the lightsaber, of course. Okay. So it's double-handed, yeah, because you do need both hands to, to use a lightsaber. Uh, Rajik's belt. Resist five. Bludgeoning. Yeah, I don't see a bowcaster, Ryog. Unless I, I'm totally missing it, right? Against melee attack. Sure, equip it. Good. Where is the... What? I don't, I didn't see that. I heard it, but I didn't see it. Maybe we need to be outside. Is the game bugging out? Okay. Karth is fine. I think Karth is fine. Yeah, I don't see a bowcaster. Definitely not. Oh, I missed the locker. Ah, I'm, I'm sorry. That happens, I guess. Okay, when I go out, it's gonna ask me to pick a party, right? So let's take Bastila, uh, let's take Karth, and let's take... Let's leave Mission behind for now. Yeah, yeah, that sounds about right. Yeah, I sh sure do. Yeah, I'm the rider who won the school race, yep. That's right. I have a message from Kendra's Ordo. He says to meet him in the cantina. Okay. Isn't that the Mandalorian that works for Davik? Yes, that one. Give his connections. You can give him his connections. You can see why it would be wise to attend his meeting. This meeting. Kendris didn't say why he wanted to meet you. He only said that he had um, an offer. You couldn't refuse. Giving his connections, you can see yes. Yeah. Okay. So he's in the cantina. Okay, thanks for the message. I'll go meet him. I would advise you not to wait too long. Mandalori Mandalorians are known for many things, but patience is not one of them. Yes, journal entry added. A messenger has informed you that Kendra's Ordo, uh, a Mandalorian, will working for... Yes, he's gonna meet us. In the cantina. Uh, which cantina, though? <laughs> The cantina we met him at, I imagine, right? Okay, so Bast here. Bastila leveled up. Attributes plus one. Point cost. What do you recommend, game? Wisdom. Yeah, she is a Jedi. And modifiers to Jedi Force points and Force Power saving throws. The Force Power of a Jedi and High Wisdom are also much harder to resist. Okay, so yeah, that looks like a wise <laughs> choice. Skills. 
skill points. Awareness. Got objects. Yeah, she is a Jedi, so awareness and stealth would be proper for her. Yeah, I'm gonna take that, yes. Powers. Using a force power requires force points. Your light dark mode side rating affects the force points cost of some powers. The further you stray to the dark side, the more expensive light side powers become, okay? And the less expensive dark side powers become, and vice versa. Okay. So. Force Aura. When this power is activated, the Jedi is temporarily granted a plus two bonus to defense and with uh, an O saving throws, the effect lasts for 20 seconds. Restricted by armor. Does that mean we can't wear armor if you want to use that force power? Burst of speed. Force valor. Okay, so the blue ones are light side. Dark side power, okay. Mm, universal power, so dark side, universal, and light side. Stun droid is a... Isn't that a dark side power? Yeah. Oh, it's light side. Oh, okay, it's light side. Right, I get it. Um, okay, stun droid. Stun. Just regular stun. Okay, so stun works on normal enemies and stun droid works on droids only, I guess. This power can send a surge of energy through a processor of a droid. Yes. Okay. Regular stun allows Jedi to assault the mind of an opponent, effectively stunning them for 9 seconds. I wonder why the game is recommending stun droid and not normal stun. Effect mind. Universal power. Wound, dark side power, yeah, makes trigger spasms in the victim's lungs, causing great pain, yeah, that sounds like dark side. Um, character level 9, we can't use that. Protection from dark side, okay, force power attacks. Mm. Hmm. Cure. Uh, what's missing? Oh, character level 6. We're not character level 6. Yes, okay. Well... Okay, um... I'm oh, sorry guys, um... <laughs> Effect mind, persuasive use of the force... We are a scoundrel and we do have some persuade, but that's just, you know, being a good talker. This might help out in those cases where that doesn't work, maybe. Mm. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Oh, that's okay. Yeah, we can't do that. Oh, I have the... Oh, I ha I'm sorry, I have the... <laughs> 
Oh, I have those in green. I get it. I get it. Fine. You know what? Let's stun droid. Sure, why not? Oh, that interface is so... Okay. Duh. Let's accept. What? What did I miss? Oh, skills? Oh, I didn't... Didn't I accept this? Wait, 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 wait. That's pastel, right? What happened? Did I spaz out or something? Oh, is it two level ups? Oh, two... what? Okay. Burst to speed. You know what? Yeah. Level 5? Oh, okay, so needed... Oh, right. Uh, three more levels, okay. So, skills. Let's go back to... Hmm. No, I, I, I'm gonna try and get her cure to compensate for lack of treat injury. What do you recommend? Really? Let me save this one for later. Yes. Feats. Force stun. Night sense. Improved two weapon. Yes, I definitely want improved two weapon fighting. Yes. Okay. Uh, didn't we? Yeah. Oh, cure. Oh, wait, wait. No. Let me go. Oh, yes. I do want to use cure. Yes. I want to turn her into a, a kind of a healer, potentially. And now we're done with the level up. Definitely closer to the lights. And yes. Okay. Wow. You could spend all day doing this. Um, okay, let's level up Karth. One level, I think, yes. Okay, so he's level 7. Remaining points 1. What do you recommend? Treat injury, yeah. Probably, that's what I'm, I would have picked, I think. Yeah, let's do that. Feats. Toughness. What's toughness? One extra vitality every time they level up. This bonus is retroactive for levels previously gained. Yeah, he is tanky. So maybe that's not a bad idea. Yeah, okay. I'm probably gonna regret some of these choices later on, but then be the games. Okay, uh, so now I'm going to... Yes? I wanna go to the... No, not Bastila. I'm here. There's her lightsaber. Yeah, there it is. Okay, we can see the lightsaber. So, um, let's save and... Apartment. Mm. We're gonna get out in the sea, right? Yeah, so that way would be quicker, I think. No, not this one. Yeah, over here. Oh uh, yeah, over right across the street. <laughs> How convenient. Something seems to be bothering Karth. Maybe you should speak to him. Oh, again. 
if you can get him one uh, if you can get him to open up about it yes okay speak to Karth don't speak to him speak to Karth yes what's on your mind I want to discuss something with you. You do? Well, fair enough. What do you want to discuss? Uh, I want to talk about the issues you seem to have with me. We didn't finish our... Is that going to work? We didn't finish our conversation last time. I know you wouldn't understand where I was coming from. Let me try and explain. You're probably one of the most skilled women I've ever met. You've saved my butt more than once, and I'm lucky to have you here to help me. Uh-oh. No question. But that doesn't mean that I'm gonna stop watching you being wary. I'm just not built that way. Period. Why are you so hostile? What did I do to deserve this? You, uh, you haven't done anything yet. <laughs> There's no guarantee that yet. you won't do anything in the future. I've been betrayed before by people, and I... It won't happen. Uh, oh, this is not going well. None of these are good. So you want some guarantee that I won't betray you? I don't know that you'll betray me, but there are no guarantees. Not for you, not for me. You don't have to take it personally. No. Oh, wait. Okay, I'm not gonna... <laughs> Okay, I do take it personally. Well, that's too bad then, because I'm not going to change. Oh, that didn't go well, did it? I'm not sure where I went wrong. Uh, you sure you don't want to talk about it? No, I don't want to talk about it. Oh, damn but I it! Want us to save the galaxy, if that's even possible. Why is whether or not I trust you or anyone so damned important to you? Why, why do you even care? We don't have time for this, so can we please mm. just drop it for now? Can we pick it up later if you really must? I'm, I want to get underway. Hmm. Despite being impressed with your abilities, Kart is still not willing to fully open up to you. Maybe if you give him some time. <laughs> sure. Take your time, Kart. Who knows? Uh, where was the cantina? Wait. Yeah, up ahead. There's the cantina. I saw you in the swoop race. Very impressive. You seem like you know how to get results. That's just the kind of person I'm looking for. <laughs> Wouldn't it be funny if we asked him again who he was? What are you talking about? My name's Candorus Ordo. I work for Davik Kang in the exchange. I know. The hours aren't great, but they promised anyway. me a fortune to work for them. And I have nothing better to do. Mandalorian mercs like me are in high demand. But lately... Davik hasn't been paying me what he promised. I don't like getting cheated. So I figure it's time for me to break the Sith quarantine and get off this backwater. That flat. sounds good. Uh, how do you plan to do that? I've got a plan to escape Taurus, but I can't do it alone. I need someone I know can get the job done to help me. That's where you come in. Careful. Mercs like this having a lick of conscience. They'll betray you in a heartbeat. This could be a trap. I ain't talking to you. I'm talking to your friend. Arna, I saw you win that swoop race and started thinking. Anyone crazy enough to race like that is hmm. probably crazy enough to break into the Sith military base. I need someone to steal the Sith launch codes from the base. Without those codes, any ship leaving the atmosphere will be disintegrated by the Sith fleet's automated defense guns. Uh, do you happen to know them, Jaren? <laughs> yeah, all Mandalorians must know each other. <laughs> Um, I don't know, he's a mark, maybe he'll understand. What's in this for me? Here's the deal. 
You bring me those launch codes, and I can provide the vehicle to get us off the planet. Davik's flagship, the oh, Ebon Hawk. The Ebon Hawk. How are you going to manage that? Uh uh, uh not yet. <laughs> First, you bring me the launch codes. Then I'll tell you the rest of my plan. How am I supposed to get inside the military base? Getting in won't be easy. The Sith base is protected by an encrypted security system. <laughs> it would take a top-of-the-line astromech droid to slice through it. Lucky for you, I know just the place to get a droid like that. Davik was having one custom built by Janice Nall. Just tell her Kander has sent you and she'll sell you the droid. Then you can use it to get the launch codes from the Sith base. Won't Davik get mad if I take his droid? Davik paid for the droid, but I'm the guy he put in charge of the mission. He won't care how I come up with those codes. Fair enough. Normally I do this myself, but everyone knows who I work for. If I broke into okay. the Sith base, that makes sense. they'd send an army down on Davik's estate to get those codes back. That's why I need you. Okay, Kendris, you got a deal. I don't sense any deception from him, which is surprising. This may be exactly what we need. I'm going to wait in Javiar's cantina. You come and find me when you've got those launch codes, and I'll make sure we both get off this run. Great. So he's just gonna have a drink while we go and do the dangerous mission? There he goes. Alright. Purchasing a droid. Kendris is told yes. Jenna Snow, yeah. So that's the girl with the droids, yes. Janice. Nice name. Why is this still? I saw you. Okay. He just goes from cantina to cantina. Yeah. The life of a famous Mandalorian. Okay. So let's get out of the cantina in that case. For now at least. The, the aluminum mallard? <laughs> what the hell's an aluminum falcon? Okay, where was the shop? Clinic? To the upper city over here. Um, the equipment emporium. Well, when you wanna... Tell me I'm slouching you work, do you stream labs? I know I'm slouching. Yeah, I'm not sure what part of the town she was in. Basil, but I was wondering something. Oh. How did those Vulcans manage to capture a famous Jedi? Or were you knocked out when your escape pod crashed? No, I was conscious. But my force powers were exhausted from using my battle meditation in the battle for the Ender Spire. Without my help, you might have never gotten off the ship alive. Fair enough, but I've seen you Jedi in action. There's, there's no way those thugs could have stood a chance against your lightsaber. My lightsaber was misplaced. What? I couldn't find it after the crash. I looked everywhere in that pod. The Vulcans came and overwhelmed me even as I was searching for my weapon. Where? Let me get this straight. You lost your lightsaber? <laughs> I mean, isn't that a violation hmm, of some kind of fishy. Jedi code or something? Okay. Um, if all the Jedi in the galaxy, why do we get? <laughs> uh, maybe losing lightsaber is side effect of her battle meditation. Leave her alone. Okay. Is this a? Is this some kind of weird non-love love triangle that's forming here? Um, maybe losing lightsabers is a side... Oh, is that is that making fun of her, though? Okay, I'm not gonna go with this one, because that's just, just too... Uh, okay. This is no laughing matter. During the crash, my lightsaber must have... It, it must have fallen from my belt and rolled under my seat. The Vulcans probably found it there when they searched the wreckage. Hey, 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 don't get mad. I'm okay, sorry. Okay. It's okay. funny to think of a... Legendary Jedi losing her lightsaber. Take my advice. This is one detail you might want to keep out of the history taxes. I hardly consider myself a legend, Carth. Though I will consider your advice when I relate these events to the Jedi Council. 
There is no need for them to know every detail of what transpired. That was a thing with that just happened. Uh, wait. Uh, that's the okay. That's the clinic, right? Uh, let's go to the other part. Hey, get out of my way, please. Uh, I've got a glossy cover cover to the right of me so I can kind of make out my outline and I am Mr. Banana lots of times during the day, not good. Aha. Uh -huh. Can you elaborate on that? Do you want, do I want to, do I want you to elaborate on that? That sounds, hmm, okay, um, so that's the apartments, yes, droids by Janice over here, I think we took, Bastila, did you ever think about joining all the Jedi who were running off to follow Revan and Malak when they went to fight? I keep calling it. That was nearly five years ago. Oh. I was still an apprentice, okay. my battle meditation hadn't even manifested itself. Yet even then I had the wisdom to obey the will of the Council, unlike Revan. I guess. Still, do you ever wonder I know he's supposed to be called Revan, I would keep Revan calling him Malik Revan. still have been corrupted if the Council had supported them instead of dragging its feet? Do not blame Revan's corruption on the Council. Your Republic saw only the threat of the Mandalorians, but the wisdom of the Masters saw beyond the immediate threat. Yeah, I get it, Marshall. Yes, sorry, <laughs> took me took me a moment. Okay, uh, what did they see exactly? There is something lurking out there, something that devoured Revan and Malak and many other Jedi. Had the Council sent us all into the unknown, how many more would have fallen? So you're saying we should have done nothing, just let the Mandalorians conquer us on the post? I mean, the Republic was under attack, and the Order abandoned us. We did not abandon you. But the council were not about to throw lives away foolishly. Hmm. In time, we would have aided you against the Mandalorians, but you couldn't wait. Revan and Malak offered a quicker answer, and the Republic chose to walk the easy path rather than the path of wisdom. Now we see the results all around us. You asked me if I think things could have been different. I know they could have. If Revan had only listened to the council, millions of innocent people would still be alive. Yeah, right. And every single one of them. Speaking of I, I think let's just get back to the task at hand. I don't want to say he has a good point, but he has a good point. Child. You ever seen a swoop bike? Yes. I seen them at the races. I rode one. Butler seems to have something on her mind. Perhaps you should talk to her about it, sure. Speak to Bastila. How can I help? You want to talk about something? I would like to know what happened after you crashed on Taurus. I'm curious as to what you and Karth were doing before we all joined forces. We were looking for you. Yes, I realize that, of course. But surely there was more to it than a simple search. I doubt there were flashing signs pointing you in my direction. Yet somehow you found Oh, now you're curious, huh? Detection by the Sith discovered I was a Vulcan prisoner, gained sponsorship for the race, and became the Taurus Swoop champion. That's quite a resume. Only took three streams. Um, I had a lot of help. Cards, mission, Zobar. Your modesty is admirable. But though others helped, you were the catalyst for these events. When you were chosen to join this mission, I doubt any of us expected this much from you. The Jedi could have done such things, of course. But only by drawing heavily upon the force. Are you trying to say I can control the force? The force is in all of us. Though for most people it's barely a measurable whisper. But there are some individuals outside the Jedi Order that we consider force sensitive. It's obvious to me that the force has been working through you. There is no other explanation for your great success. Though I'm not certain what to make of this discovery. Perhaps if you weren't well, if you were younger, the Jedi might take you for training, but as it is... 
she's both trying to push us towards thinking that we could maybe use the force and saying that we can't really be trained because we're too old. Yes, too old to begin the training. Uh, what are you trying to say? I'm sorry, I've overstepped my authority. I'm speaking of things that are best left to the Jedi Council. For now, let's just... But we've learned so much. Gifted. Hopefully, between your abilities, my Jedi training, and the skills of our companions, we can find a way off this planet. Hmm. <laughs> uh... Okay. Uh, Bastila has told you that she's seen signs of that the Force is acting through you. However, she was reluctant to speculate further, feeling such matters are the pro providence of the Jedi Council. It's not fair. <laughs> well, f unfortunately, Obi-Wan won't be born for another 4,000 years, so it can't be his fault this time around. Um, okay. <laughs> Where was I going? Oh yeah, droid. <laughs> Other way. I am going in the right direction, aren't I? Yes, over here. There was an exclusive... Oh. Thank you for telling me that, Tex Pex. That's not annoying at all. Okay. <laughs> okay, so Kendra said you sold a T3 M4 droid to me. Also, that's why it wasn't for sale. You can have it for 2,000 credits. Uh Wait, how much credits do we have? How many credits? How much money? How many credits? You can count credits. Um I'll give you half. Success, half. He's yours for fifteen hundred. Okay, so we're gonna have to play some Pazak, maybe? I'll pass. Okay, I'll be going for now. We have 1016 credits, so we need to make some money. We can sell some stuff as well, I guess. Is it okay? No, well, should we go back to the cantina and play some bazaar, or should we go? Which cantina is better? Uh, the uh, the lower one, right? <laughs> See this gambling emote? Yeah. No, not the Sith base yet. Uh, I totally don't remember where the other Cantina was, but... Let me see if my hunch is right. Lacos apartment... No, not these apartments, right? Oh wait, we have to go through the elevator to the lower city. It's in the lower city, right? Yes. I want to be in the lower city. <laughs> I 
I don't know, is there a better way of doing this? How else should I get the money? Yeah, okay, over there is the elevator. And I do have the papers on me, so it should be fine, right? Got my papers. Well, why didn't you say so? Hmm. Everything seems to be in order. Okay, I guess you can go down to the lower city. Just Thank you. Down there. Yeah, yeah. Have a nice day. Don't get run over by a swoop bike or anything. Okay, um. Back base and on the other side is the cantina. Yes, okay. Right. Um. Back again. Well, ever since I was banned from the upper cantina, I've been desperate to find a good game of Bazak. You want to play? Before we do, if you're ever looking, let's just save and try to play with this guy. Back again. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, why did they ban you, by the way? A simple misunderstanding. Uh, of course. Some of the other Bazak players don't understand the finer points of the game. So what if I win 15 matches in a row? That doesn't mean I cheat. There's no justice. My lucky Bazak deck was confiscated and I was banned from the upper cantina. Mm -hmm. Since then I've been desperate to find a match. I'll play. Excellent. My funds were getting somewhat low. Mine too. Oh, I'm so bad at this. Okay, let's start with default because I have no idea what should, we should be doing. Let's wager 40 for now. Um, so we have that's the extra card we found right those are the chosen cards uh, let's get rid of one of the plus twos and add this one yes yep okay Uh, eight. We're at eight. Let's keep going. Fourteen. Mm, yeah, let's keep going. Ooh, okay. Um, no, we can't win at this point, right? Because we're 22. Yeah, we bust. I was getting too ambitious there. 15. Mm, let's do it. Oh, fudge! This is not going well. Yeah, I know. Let's do plus five from my hand and stand. Oh, damn. You played well in our last. I'll play, I'll play. Is he actually cheating, though? Thank you. Thank you, Rob. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Thank you. I would like to thank the Academy and all of that. What's gonna happen if we tell him he's cheating? How dare you accuse me of cheating? It's not my fault you lost. I'm just a good player with a strong deck. Maybe you just need more practice. Or maybe you need to buy some better cards. Go talk to Uriah over there. He can sell you some cards to improve your deck. Unless you want to play again right now. <laughs> the Jedi Academy. <laughs> 
Okay, I'll play, I'll play. Excellent. My funds were getting somewhat low. Yes, let's do 40 again. Let's do the same thing. Yes. Hit me. Hit me. Again. He's at 19. Let's do 5 for 20. Yes, okay. Oh, mini games hit me. No oh, fudge. Oh, hit me. Again. Let's draw this one. Hit me. Ooh, I can't win this one. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, stand. It's 20. 20. Oh, he won. What the fudge? 21 is blackjack and this is 20. Try again. Well, how come you keep winning, you fudger? Yeah! Okay, we tied. That was lucky. Again. Again. Stand. Yeah. And turn. No, wait. Let's do plus four. Let's stand. Yeah. You did well in our last match, but I think your luck may be about to run out. So do you want to play again? Okay, we're not gonna get to 1500, I mean, that way, right? <laughs> oh man, this is gonna take a while. Is there really no other way? <laughs> Can we ask him anything else? If you wanna ask questions, go talk to Zax in the bounty office. He knows everything that's happening on Taurus. I'm just here to play for Zack. So do you wanna play or not? Yeah, I'll play. Um, Excellent. My funds were getting somewhat low. Let's wager a hundred. Oh, we can't. Oh, maximum wager is forty. Oh. No, I don't want to threaten the the shop lady. No. Yeah, let's play like this again. You game. <gasps> oh. If only there was some kind of. Jo yes, yes, okay. We'll, we'll get to that. Let me just play this one. Let's stand. Okay. Tied. Again. Let's do plus three. Bust. Okay, good. We win this one. Yeah, this is fun. Um,
Hmm. Let's do it again. Sheesh. Oh no. Oh damn. Well. Yeah. Plus. Jeez. Okay. Hit me. Uh, stand. Oh, how come you? You played well in our last match, but luck just wasn't with you. Okay, okay. You Let's not. Again? This, this sure could, yes, this could. Yes, this could be all night. How are we going for now? If you ever look. Yeah. Okay. Journal entry added. Really? Uh-huh, okay. Right. Alright, so... Uh, let's look at our quest log. What can we do? No, not items. Active quests. Yes, okay. It's so winnable, sure. Um, David Kank has put out a legal bond on a form of associate. Patrick, yes. There's an official government bounty on a woman named Sylvan. She's a known assassin. Oh, her! Oh, right, right, okay, okay. Uh, let's try to go for for her. I think let's try with this one first. So she's she's in an apartment somewhere, right? And we tried to get her a couple of levels ago. Maybe we can get her now with a Jedi on our side. Okay, uh, let's get out of here. I know I lost forty credits and this was a waste of time, but I played some Pazak. Uh, so, this is the apartment. I really don't remember. You know what I just did? I double tapped W. Um, my mind is thinking I'm playing Oni, unfortunately. <laughs> I wanted to run quicker and that's how you do it in, in Oni. You start dashing by tapping W. Uh, yeah, over here. I'm not sure where the apartment was, but let me take a look. Uh, oh, yes, over here. Okay. We can try. What? Oh, okay. Sure, why not? Ooh, she used force push. Repair kit. Okay, so here is she. I gave you a chance to get out of here and leave me alone. But I guess you're just too stupid to take it. Yes. Now you'll see why I'm the most dangerous assassin on Taris. Okay, let's start. Let's try and do that. Let's see how that works out. Okay. It's used for a skill. So cool having a Jedi around. Someone is dead. Now all we have to do is go back to Zax to collect her bounty. Okay. Uh, where was Zax? Med pack, get items. Credits, parts, med pack, sure, good. Okay. I really, I, I really don't remember where Zax was. Um, 
Was he in a cantina? <laughs> I think, right? Lower cantina, yes, okay. So let's go back. Whoa! Sometimes you just hit an invisible wall. So I want to go back over here. No. Uh, yes, to the lower city. Back to the cantina, which is over here. Yes. Hidden back and the cantina over on this side. Okay, let's figure out where Zax was. Candrus. Uh, I figured you'd be back. Neither of us is getting off this, but we've got a small problem. I haven't heard about anyone breaking into the military base yet, so I know you don't have. Can you give us some time to work? If you want me to help you, you've got to bring something to the table. So until you get those codes, we really don't have much to talk about. Did I engage him in any way? I'll be back with those codes. Glad to hear it. I'll be waiting right here. He needs a confirmation. Maybe he's that way. Uh, hold him. Nope. Um, nope. Bib. Um, nope. Wait, he should be in here, right? That's Candorous. Suru. Bounty Hunters. Oh, that's, oh, he's the, he's the heart, yeah. Okay. Okay, um... Raku serum. I've got a bounty I want to collect on. Which bounty are you here to collect? Tell him about Sowen. Or oh, the other bounty hunters who went uh, handled. Uh, yes. You did well, human. Thank you. 300. Well, that's a start. Could we try persuade? Yes. <laughs> He's a cat, all right. Thank you. <laughs> okay. Let me ask again about the bounties. Oh, she, uh, yeah, he gave us. Uh, yes, okay. Entry added 400. Okay. So, Sylvan's bounty is completed. Bendak, a famous duelist. He's in this container as well, right? Oh, the, the upper container, right? He's in the upper container. Well, I'm not sure I can... Okay, let's save and try. Why do I remember? Maybe I... Yeah, I remember it wrong. Okay, so uh, that leads us to the low, back to the lower city. Um, wait, let's go 
Not to the Volker base, not to the Undercity, but not to the apartments. Over here to the upper city, yes. Yeah, my spatial awareness is just... Okay, I have to go back to the other part of town, right? Over here. Yeah, I want to be over here. No, what am I even doing? Why, am, why is it so difficult for me to get around? <laughs> hey, Entropy. <laughs> I think you've been waiting to say that all night. Yeah, okay. Right, over to the city. <laughs> You're right, yeah. The container should be over here, right? Yes, yes. Good. By the time I'm done with this, I will remember some of the layout of the city. <laughs> okay, let's go to that cantina and see how quickly we die. Uh, I'm going to be a responsible adult and go to bed. I've been starving, uh, starving, uh, staving off. Wow, fancy. Uh, staving off sleep until I cleaned the bathroom and I had a shower. Yeah, go, go get yourself some sleep. I'll be I'll check on you in a bit. Everybody say goodnight to Entropy. Okay, so... Star Killer is with the duelists, right? Tiger got his match, thank you. No, those are the dancers in the band. He should be in here, right? Sure, I'll try. Ice? Where is Bandak, though? He's not here. Wait. What? Panda has been known to frequent the areas in the upper container near the dueling ring. Sure, maybe he's not in this room? Bandak's not here? We are in the right container, yeah? But he's just not around? Wait, should I enter the duels to to actually beat him? 
he was around here. I know he was around here. I, I remember speaking to him. Oh, of course I was. Thank you. Oh, hey! Oh, how is this gonna go? Wait, I'll be going now. Yes, let's save before we do anything. Rory, you wanna come over? Yep, yep, yep. Jump off. Jump off, sweetie. There you go. Good girl. Now, you're not gonna be a nuisance, are you? Okay. Back again? You're starting to bore me. I don't come here to talk. I come to watch the duels and see if there's anyone worthy of stepping into the ring with me. I'm here to collect the bounty on your head, Bendak. So you're the one doing Zax's dirty work. Well, I've got some bad news for you, little bounty hunter. There's no way you're bringing me in. This cantina is wired with a top-level security grid. You pull a weapon on me and the auto-fire turrets will fry you before you can even pull the trigger. Sure, so that's not gonna work. So you just hide in here like a coward? How is this gonna go down? Why would I ever want to leave here? I've got food and drinks, place to stay, and everybody treats me with the respect I've earned for my bullying career. But if you're set on collecting that bounty, I'll make you a deal. I kinda miss the fight game. My hand is itching for the feel of a blaster in my grip. If you can prove yourself in the ring by beating all these other so-called duelists, oh. I'm gonna face you in a death match. You win? You get to collect the bounty. I for see, killing. I see where this is going. Yeah. Or no, rather, who knows. Okay, I'll be back as soon as I beat all the Good other duelists. You're gonna need it. <laughs> you sure you want to get involved in this? Seems a bit pointless to me. Up to you. <laughs> Carth just said do you really want to do this side quest for 300 or whatever? <laughs> yeah, I do because we need them. Well, we could gamble the rest, I guess. But let me try and get this one. I think it will be quicker. Okay, should I go and... Oh, no. Where was the dueling room? Or rather, the room with the duelists. Should I? Can I? Yes, this guy. Yes, I do. Okay, I might be interested. What's in it for me? I can arrange for you to fight in the duel ring. If you win, you get the standard contract. 10% of all wagers. And don't worry, nobody dies in the duel ring anymore. That matches are legal. Why do I get the feeling this is not gonna go down well? Most fighters in the dual ring use vibroblades or stun sticks because blasters. Use whichever you prefer. Okay, so we're not good with we're not good with either, really. Vibroblades and blasters, and nobody ever dies. How come I get the feeling you're trying to take us for a ride? Energy suppressor. Yeah, weapons are limited, so that they hurt. Okay. Let's try and roll the dice. I'll do it, but I want more than 10%. Failure. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, I'll do it. My name is Corey Jade, it's better. Really? Sure. This is for the best. We could use those credits from these duels, but using your real name is too risky. Oh. The Sith might have come across a crew manifest back on the Yeah, that was a brain fart on my part. <sighs> okay, so... Let's say we're ready for a duel.
One goes down, you don't finish them off, that matches her Livio now, okay. Dead Eye! Okay, let's do it. Ladies and gentlemen, draw your eyes to the I can't believe I'm doing this. We have a very special presentation in store for you. You've seen him lose night after night after night, <laughs> but this time he's after fresh meat. In this corner, I give you Dead Eye Duncan. And in the other corner, a relative newcomer to the Taris dueling scene. Emerging from the shadows with no history, no past, and no name. The mysterious stranger. Okay. During yes, okay. Well, <laughs> I'm getting the feeling it's not gonna be as easy later on. Okay, okay, the mysterious stranger. Can we talk to Deadeye now? No, where is he? Yes. Oh, look at his health bar. What do you want? Oh, let me guess. You beat me in the dueling ring and now you're gonna rub it in my face. Yeah, well, I'm used to it. So pardon me if I ignore your gloating. Yeah. Uh, can I ask you some questions? Questions? I don't have to answer your questions just because you beat me in the ring. Look, I admit it, you're better than me. Everyone's better. Looks like me. most people are. Yes, everyone. One-legged attack with a rusty knife could probably beat me. Okay, is that what you wanted to hear? You satisfied yet? Are you happy now that you've taken the last shred of dignity I have? Oh, I'll just be going now. Oh well. Okay. Goodbye then. Sorry, Duncan. I, I wonder if there was any intent on part of whoever wrote this to call this guy Duncan. Duncan is. The, the master swordsman, the master uh, armsmith of um, the armory guy for House of Trades. He's he's the best, you know. And <laughs> this guy. <laughs> anyway, okay. So let's say we need to save this, and if we want to do another duel, do we do that? <laughs> Credits, 100. Okay, so... Ooh! We're actually very close to... Our 1500, if we can get to 1500 in that negotiation again. Let's save, let's try another duo though. I'm ready for a duel. Gerlon Two Fingers. Just remember, Gerlon uses blasters in the ring sometimes. Sure. Let's do it. Ladies and gentlemen, draw your eyes to the center ring. We have a very special presentation. Oh, I have a bad feeling about this. In this corner, one of the greats, a man so tough, even a disfiguring injury couldn't end his career. <laughs> I give you Gerlon Two Fingers. And in the other corner, a relative newcomer to the Taris ruling <laughs> scene, emerging from the shadows with no history, no past, it's just and great. no name, the mysterious stranger. Okay, let's try to do the same thing essentially. Is it gonna be illegal to throw a grenade at him? Let's see. It 
fight's over! The fight is over! The mysterious stranger has won! That didn't seem legal to me. Losing to a rookie. Is this a sign that his injuries have finally caught up with him? Or is the mysterious stranger for real? Only time That's cheating! <laughs> Thank you. Okay, experience points, 80. Let's go talk to the guy. Good fight, good fight. People like you. Makes me happy and rich. Let's get my debts. You, uh, let's pay my debts. You want? So we get paid. 10% of the uh, of the purse. That's what. That's the deal. Here's your credits. You can see me when you're ready to fight again. Okay, so we get 200 credits. Hmm. It's close. 16... 1681. 1681. So let's save and let's see if we can do that thing we need to do. I know we probably need to do more for now. Let's try. Where is the exit? Damn it. On the other side of where I am, as per usual. Nope. Why am I so bad at moving around? Yes, maybe I should take a look at the signs. Hey, Bendak. <laughs> okay, so let's go back. Yes. Um. To the other part, right? That's the cantina. I think I want to go to. That's the clinic, right? Uh, upper city over here, yes. I love the background music, always nice to listen to. And incidentally, it reminds me of the Star Trek Insurrection soundtrack. I know it's silly that this reminds me of Star Trek, but there you go. Okay, so over here, right? Yo, where? Welcome in, how are you doing? Death base, Troids by Jams, yes, over to the left. How are you doing tonight, Yor? Yes, okay, let's see how this goes. Hachu Apanki, Jishawa Anibun Kasha, Chonasi. Okay, so Kendra said you give me the droid. Okay, um, I'll give you half. Oh, fudge! Okay, I'll pass. Let's try it again, because it's a dice throw, right? Okay. Hachu a punky. Kendra, yes. Okay. Uh, the price is outrageous. Yes, good. 1500. It's a deal. T3 and 4 join the party. Hey, T3. Level 3 expert droid. Uh, we do want him in the party, right? So let's keep Bastila, Karth, and the droid. Yes. Yay. Wait.
Didn't I take the droid? No, I don't. If she's not gonna... What did I do? I'm so confused. Yes, I can... Right, I can have two party members. Right, so... Uh, how do I go for the selection screen again? Yes, I know I can have two, but... Which one did I... Ooh. If I want to go to the selection screen, I can just return to the high dive, right? Teleport to base. Yes, okay. Um, no, wait. Party selection. There you go. Let's get rid of Karth. Let, no, get remove Karth. Yes, party selection. Over here. Like that. Yes, okay. You're gonna have to... We're gonna have to work without Karth for a while. First try, yeah. Uh, now we go to the lower cantina to talk to that guy, right? Um, yes, exactly, I think. Uh, over here is where the elevator is. No? Where's Kandras? He's in the upper cantina? Okay. Um, back here then, right? Listen to me, people. That is a oh, I'm going to the Sith base. Right, right. I'm trying to do the mission now. I don't want to talk to him before we do the mission. What did he tell you last time? Yes, okay. Yeah. See, I remembered, I remembered. Okay, so the... Uh, let me just take a look at the round. All your base belong to us, yes. Uh, so here is the droids by Janus, apartments. Sith base is over here. Okay. Uh, let's see if we can do something with the droid before we goof around. Okay, so... Wow. Droid light pl uh, plating type 1 is equipped. No items for utility. Right now he has a shield disruptor equipped. Stun ray equipped. Energy shield level 1 equipped. That's all we have. And we can equip him with an, a weapon, an additional weapon. Okay. Okay, I don't think I can do much else, right? What is it, Rory? Oh, you're so sweet. Wait a second, wait. There you go. <laughs> She's being so cuddly. Wait a minute, okay. You wanna settle down? Okay. Oh, look at him! He's so cute! Hey, M3! Oh! T3, M4. T3, not M3. Okay, my bad. Okay, so level up right now. Ooh, wow! Okay. Uh, oh. What do you recommend? Dexterity. Really? For the droid? Well, we're not gonna do charisma or wisdom. Intelligence. Constitution. Dexterity. Strength. Yeah, it actually makes sense to do dexterity for the droid, right? 
Okay, skills. Mm, four points. Computer use, demolitions, repair security. Okay, so point cost is one over here. Computer use, point cost is one. Let's do computer use, security, um, repair. cost one yeah um not sure I want to do demolitions should I save that point yeah I want to increase computer use to one of the yeah well all seven right now yeah I'm gonna save this one because I'm gonna carry over to the next uh, level up right and I'm gonna accept and we go to the next level because we have a lot of stuff. Okay, so let's do computer use, let's do repair and security. Mm. Let's do that. Okay. Feats. What do you recommend, game? Improved gearhead. Gearhead. Plus two skill bonus to repair security and computer use. Yes. That's I think that's that's not a bad idea. Uh, yeah, add feet, yes. Okay. Alright, and accept. Okay. Uh, one more level or two skills. Okay, uh, let's do one more security. Computer use one more. Repair and oh, oh, that's two. Yeah, two. Okay. All right. So let's save this one over then. Yes. And ex feats. Tactician logic upgrade. Putting feet this level. Can okay, witness the effects and actions of combat firsthand? The droid is able to self upgrade their defensive algorithms. This feat grants plus four to defense and is always active, so that's a passive skill. This 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 feat replaces the combat logic upgrade. Uh huh. Well I'm not yeah, oh mm. Okay, so this is combat logic upgrade and this will be tactician logic upgrade. Yes, so I have this automatically. Good. So what do you recommend? Improved caution. What does that mean? Let me see. Uh, so caution is this basic skill. Plus one skill point bonus to both demolition and stealth. And this gives us plus two to demolition and stealth. This replaces the okay. Yeah, I'm gonna. And this is pretty. Yeah, let's do. Uh, yeah, let's do that. Yep. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. Okay. I accept. Okay. Rory, you want to? What do you? What do you want to do? You want to come over here or stand there? Come. Come on. Whoa. You know, she's been jumping more lately. <laughs> more than she used to. She, yeah, she wants cuddles right now. If you if you be patient for a while. She's really cute. Okay, um where are we going? Stealth. Uh yeah, uh, base. Yeah. Set base over here. Wait, I want to do What can I do? Uh, Cora, Cora. Let's work with Cora. Over there, on the other side, where the the Sith fighters are. Right. Shut up, you thing. Rory heard something. I think Entropy is putting down food. <laughs> right, 
almost sounded bad. Okay, so... Let me just try. Yeah. Alright. Settle down, my sweetie. Uh, there he goes. Nice job, T3. Okay, that was quick. You can't come in here, this is a tricky area. You better tell me what you're doing or I'm going to hit the alarm. Okay, can we persuade her not to do that, please? Okay. I'm here for a meeting. Look, here's 50 credits. Just don't hit the alarm. Um, Don't worry. I know where I have to go. Oops. Okay. Let's try persuade again. Here's 50 credits. Just don't hit the alarm. Do we have 50 credits? <laughs> I live in here ever since they took yes, I imagine so. It's about time someone stood up to the... Oh, so that that's how it took? 50 credits? Okay. <laughs> we have a couple more. Alright. Uh, she's just... <laughs> going away. Uh, that worked okay. Alright. Reception terminal. We have how many spikes? 13. Uh, let me log out for a second before we do anything. Okay. Anywhere else to go other than the basic room? That's where we came in. Standard door over here. And another standard door over there. Do we want to... I don't know. Let's go explore a bit. Uh, what's T3's computer skill? Computer use. Uh, skill bonus plus 7, so total rank is 16, right? Can he do anything with the computer? One spike, which decreases... Yeah, yeah, okay, so we want to use his... If we're gonna spike this, we want to use T3, right? What? Oh, that looked like something. It is something. Nope. I pressed load. That's okay. Let me just walk around a bit. Uh, that was a bad idea, walking around a bit. Well, you cannot win. You shall fall. Hey, I helped. First aid. The hardest kill. Yes. I, yeah, I'm, I'm catching on to that. Yep. Med pack two. Med pack. What about the other one? Oh no, not lootable. Okay. Remains. Computer probe. Energy shield. Droid level plating one. Okay. How are you doing? You're doing good. Okay, okay. Wait. I'm here. To find the first power. Hello. 
How can I help? Okay. All right. Can I, I, I get it. I get it. On? Yes. 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 Okay. I'm here. Uh, nope. No, not Bastila. Uh, Cora. What? Yes. Should we take a look behind more standard doors to see what trouble lies? Ooh. Two of them. She's really good with that lightsaber, isn't she? It's with there. Can we try? Scale too low, okay. Let's disable it. Okay. Supplies? Supplies! <laughs> what is it? Okay, jump up. Come on. Come on. There you go. Good girl. <laughs> okay, security terminal over here. Hey, T3, you wanna check this out? No, 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 no. Can't go there. No, no climbing on the desk. Not allowed. Um, let me log out for a second. Let me save and do that. You want to say something to the mic? <laughs> Let's do one spike. Access system commands. Take turrets offline. Or spikes. Oh, I should have done that earlier, right? Upload area schematics, overload terminal, return to root menu. How many spikes do I have? Nah, security cameras. So, barracks. Oh, <laughs> okay. Secondary barracks. We can overload the conduit for one spike. Reception, that's where we came from. Medical. Okay. Control center. Elevator. Whoa. He has a shield. Six spikes. Mm. Armory. Mm. Let's lock out for. Yeah, I, I, I know. I, I sort of wasted that, right? But let me load. <laughs> and it's not going to be wasted that way. I'm not sure what I want to do yet. That's why. Okay. Um, I'm here. Let's go back to Cora. This is where we are. That's the entrance, that's the reception, the computer terminal at reception over there, yeah. Well, hmm. let's see what's in here. That's in here. Bastard, you want to do something about these guys? Okay. Yes. Who's this? She helped me once before when the Sith were trying to arrest me. Oh! Really? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah! 
At the very beginning, right. Right, I remember you. I think, right? Oh, removing the Sith corpse. Oh, yeah, he's the guy that uh, said he's gonna take care of the corpse. Yes, yes, okay. Uh, how do I get you out? To show the panels on the wall. Switching a panel will also switch the panel beside it. Great. Because I'm awake enough for a puzzle. Just be careful as you do it. If you set all the panels to the green on position. D is over here. Okay. So let's save. Rosie, welcome in. It's going okay. We've been going, f we've been going for three hours twenty minutes so far. Yeah, we've made some progress. Hope you're doing well. Okay, so if we do this one, it's gonna be green, but the other ones are gonna be red, right? Uh, yeah. Okay. If we do this. J Wobbles I'm here to look when I finished the work day. Welcome in Um SO work for Rosie? I have no idea, yeah, but Rosie should get a a shout out regardless. Welcome in J Wobbles. I'm I hope I'm not butchering your name. Please let me know if I am. I hope your the rest of your work day goes well. Alright, oh well, let me think about this. I'm not caffeinated enough to do this. Well, careful. Okay. Uh, um. I'll get it eventually. Yeah, GV was in here a while back. He hasn't played it, so, you know. Wait a minute, wait a minute. I must leave this place. Okay. Uh, what happened? <laughs> light side points gained. Okay, so we rescued this guy to, to gain some light side points. Um, and that puzzle was easier than it looks when you think about it. Let me save over here. Uh, okay. We can carry on, I guess. Whoa, 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 okay. Flurry. Sure. Flurry him. You know what? I like lightsabers. <laughs> okay. And I like the fact that our lightsaber is yellow at this point. Whoa, 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 okay, um, let's try flurry, no, attack and then flurry on him. Uh, 
Uh, not good. Did he run away or something? Okay. Okay, okay, good. <laughs> what? Yeah, why is he doing that? I have no idea. <laughs> Improved energy cell Sith base pass card. Okay. Is this a container? No. New items. A standard ID card for Sith troopers. Wait, what do we want to get again? Codes. What kind of codes? Let's loot the remains. Credits, adrenal strength, sure, sure, good. The nuclear launch codes, yes. This is not working. And she's down. <laughs> Have a good look. Thank you so much again. <sighs> okay, this is not gonna work. <laughs> okay, I don't think we wanna... Open that door. Yeah, we don't, do we? Okay. Now let's explore a bit more. Interesting. Credits, always welcome. Anything else? That's an interesting... Is that a suit? Yeah, those are suits. Okay, over here. We haven't been that way. Yeah, yeah, okay. Rusted sentry? I'm gonna leave him alone for now. I don't want to wake him up just yet. Okay, so there's a mine over here. Uh, let's go to Cora and let's have her disable the mine first. Or disarm it rather. Whoa, what was that? Oh, come on, that didn't work well. <sighs> yeah, okay, let's switch to Bastila. Um. Yes. T3, let me load. Hmm? Let's run ahead. Let's open this. Nope. I'm here. Hmm. Oh 
Oh, damn it, misses. Yeah, okay. okay. Let's see if we can survive that. Yeah, come on. Good. All right. What can I do? We don't have enough force power yet to cure ourselves. Let's just wait a bit. We're not gonna be wasteful about this. This is not great, but let me save. Uh, let's switch to Cora. Uh, we're over here, All right? Okay. Ooh, that seems dangerous. It's over here still. Disable it. Oh, that's another one, maybe. Okay, good. Yeah, that's where we came from. Yeah, and that's another one. Both entrances, I guess. Warble, warble yourself too, Mr. Computer. Uh, I'm here. Heal yourself. Okay, just a bit. That's fine. Good. Okay. Test repair kit. Repair kit. I'm <laughs> how, here. how handy. Okay. Let's do that. How many? Oh, sentry. Okay. Oh, wait. Stun droid? Left click the mouse to activate and hostile power selected in the second icon. Okay. Oh, well, we didn't get to the stun, but, you know, that's fine. <laughs> How many? Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. So everyone, essentially. Maybe I should have overloaded stuff. Okay, so let's try... Who who is down? Who is down? We are down. Oh, everybody's down. Just M3 is alive. Okay. Let me try that again. <laughs> yeah, these things happen. Wait, did we? Yes, over here. So that was... <laughs> armory. Yeah, that's the armory. Locked. No, wait. Let's uh, try to unlock it. Good. Done. Okay, so... The mine is over there, and... Yeah... Are you still enjoying this? Oh yeah, I am. I'm having a lot of fun doing this. It's very complicated, but I'm having a lot of fun doing it. Okay, so the sentry droids... No. Can we target the sentry droids in any way to disable them? No. Maybe we're just too far away. I'm here. No. Nope. Damn it. Oh, we can attack them, really? Well, why did you say so, you silly thing? Okay. What can I do? Good, good. Okay. How are you doing, Camorris? Uh, armory, weapons locker. 
Shield disruptor, flamethrower. Ooh, flamethrower? Really? Concussion grenade, sonic grenade. Disruptor rifle energy project. Deep splitter, ion rifle. That's the armory, alright. Okay. Anything else we can do over here? Doesn't look like it. Good. Wait, didn't I loot this? Oh, I almost missed it. Okay. So that's one of the doors that's gonna lead me back to, yeah, okay, to that bit. And that bit over here is the one I didn't explore, right? The barracks. And oh, was the droid over here? I'm so confused at this point. That's okay, that's okay. I mean the big dangerous droid. I'm just editing one of my stream bits. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, I can see how that might happen. Video editing software can be real heavy. That was the droid, right? Yes. Yes, I get it, I get it. Give me a second. I don't want to do that yet. Uh, right. Let me just try... Hmm. Okay, let me try a couple of these. No. The shield is just... Caps lock switches to first person. Nice time to figure that out. Oh, that's so trippy. Okay. Um, now, let me go back over here and... Wasn't there... Wh where was... I need a panel. No, not here. Back in, it's in the central one. Because I want to see if... I think I could do something about that droid. No, uh, we want to use T3. He's better at this stuff right now. Okay, so slicing is the computer. What was the deal? Turrets, sentry droids, six spikes. We have eleven spikes. Can we take them offline? Is that a sentry droid over there? No, that's not a sentry droid, is it? But let me see though. Worth checking. Yes. 
Yonder! <laughs> Welcome in, how are you doing? Thank you so much for the seven months! Oh man, it's been seven months! Thank you so much! Yonder! Seven! Thank you, Yonder! How are you? Rory, you're not helping, you know? Yeah, can we... Oh, I should have checked with the security camera, shouldn't I? You're right. It did occur to me the moment I logged out. Let me try it again. I don't want to waste that spike. Sleepy? I'm getting there as well. <laughs> oh, what am I doing? I'm so terrible at this. Yes, I want to go down that corridor over here. Go uh, back. Oh, really? Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, I was under the wrong impression. That's very good to know. Well, I would have figured it out anyway <laughs> once I run out of stuff. Mm. No, uh, T3. Come over here, buddy. There you go. Let's slice into it. So let's go. All system commands. Sentry droids offline. Let's check the security cameras now. Uh, so, barracks. Medical. Control center. Elevator. The sentry droid. It, it's not the sentry droid. This is, oh! Assault droid. Damn it. Let's do it again. Okay, we don't want to turn off sentries because we. I think we killed most of them. So I'm going to log out. Yeah, I know, I know. I'm gonna load again. I'm gonna go back and disable the... Yeah, I really should be more careful when I take a look at stuff, but... Oh, well. Again, yes, exactly. T3? Spike into it. Cameras. Elevator. Thank you. And I'm gonna disable the control droid shield. Six and four is ten if I need to open the elevator manually. I'm gonna run out of spikes though. Okay, so the shield is disabled now. Thank you. Okay, return to root menu. Let's see if we can take him out like this. Okay. I'm here. Yeah. Do I want to save? Yeah, I want to save. Okay, you're not gonna be that tough with your shield off. I hope. Okay, so let's stun. Let's flurry after the stun. Really? What are you doing? The droid!
Come on. What are the odds? Never tell me the odds. Finally. Okay. Transformer. Robots in disguise. Uh. T3? Nothing? Okay. Can we hack this? Uh, we don't need to hack it. We just open it. <laughs> okay. I'm here. Thank you. Sith base. So we're in another level. On another level of the Sith base. Who dares to break my meditation? You will uh -oh. pay for interrupting my... Wait. I sense the Force is strong with you. Very strong. Who would have thought a Force Adept could be found on this insignificant planet? But your talent is no match for a disciple of the Dark Side. Really? Yeah, I'm gonna try. He's not gonna do it, but I'm gonna be, you know, noble and all. Turn away from the dark side. It won't lead to anything but destruction. Spoken like a true drone of the Jedi Council. We Sith, however, have learned to embrace the potential of the dark side. It is what gives us strength. This meeting is a stroke of luck for me. My master will surely reward He's an apprentice. My saber once I kill you. Not gonna happen, bud. Okay. Um... So, cure yourself first. No. No, wait. Yes. Let's cure. Yeah, like that, like that, okay. And like that. Whoa! Okay, she's out of commission. That's not good. Hmm? Uh, not good at all. This is not gonna work. Yes. No. Let's flurry, flurry. Oh, come on. A bit more? Come on, there we go. The force fights with me. <sighs> okay, okay, good. And that wasn't pathetic, at least. Fast repair kit, repair kit. There we go. Nice going, bud. Okay. So, Taris launch launch codes. There we go. Adrenaline amplifier, energy shield, journal entry added. Escaping Taris. You've recovered the departure codes. You need to escape Taris. Now you have to bring them back to Candorus Ordo in the lower city cantina. Yes. Thank you. Anything else we can loot? Security spike, thank you. Door steel bonding alloy. Get him, get him. Good, good, good. Over here. 
cri Thank you. We're not poor anymore. Okay. Now, let's see if we can get out of here just as easily. Yeah, okay. That was just the Sith apprentice fight area, essentially. Uh, and we've actually uncovered most of this, so let's get out of here. <laughs> Wait, I could have taken a shortcut. <laughs> yeah. Oh no, that's... Yeah, I want to be over here and the entrance is over here. Yes, straight ahead. Wow, that went much better than I expected. We just infiltrated the Sith base and got out alive. So now we need to go to the lower city cantina to talk to Candras, right? So we need to take the elevator over here to the lower city, yes. That is correct, the mundo. Nope. I bet next time we finish the tutorial plan. Hey, I'm having fun. <laughs> Whatever's going on, I'm having fun. I don't care that it's the tutorial planet. <laughs> There we go. The Sith Guard doesn't even ask us anymore about this. Okay. Uh, Kendris, this way. Yep. Kendris! I figured you'd be back. Neither of us is getting off this planet unless we work together. Now, I know the Sith military base had a break-in. And I know it was you. I know you've got those departure codes I need. So what do you say? We join forces, and I can get you inside Davik's base. And right to the Ebon Hawk. We can go right now. Do we want to go right now? Hmm. Okay, let, let's try to do this. Okay, let's join up, but how are you going to get me inside Davik's estate? Davik's always looking to recruit new talent. I'll tell him how you won that swoop race and mention that you're interested in working for the exchange. I'll say I brought you in so he could check you out. He'll have you stay at his estate for a couple of days while he runs some background checks on you. That's standard procedure. This is too risky. We should find another way. You got another plan, sister? Or are you it just might end free roaming. Think of it. No, I don't have another plan. I would rather not place my life in your hands, however. I can say the same about you. That makes us even. Mm. Fortunately, we both want to get off this rock, right? While Davik's checking you out, we steal the Ebon Hawk and escape Taurus. It's not Come a bad on. plan. I've got an air speeder you know nearby what? to take us to Davik's estate. The sooner we're off Taurus, the better. Kendra joined the party. Party selection screen. Okay, so let's not select Kendra's right now. Let's remove him right now. Oh, at this time he must be. Okay, so him and Bastila. Oh, we're definitely not able to do anything else before we do that. Yes, okay, I get it. Come on, I resize it at the, the moment. You summon me, Lord Malik. Oh, 
The search for Bastila is taking too long. We cannot risk her escaping Taras. Destroy the entire planet. The, the entire planet, Lord Malik. But there are billions of people on Taras. We'd be slaughtering countless innocent civilians, not to mention our own men still on the surface. Sheesh. Your predecessor once made the mistake of questioning my orders, Admiral. Surely you are not so foolish as to make the same mistake. Of, of course <sighs> not, my Lord Malik. I will do as you command, but it will take several hours to position our fleet. Then I suggest you begin immediately. You are dismissed, Admiral. Yes, Lord Malik. So, Candorus, I see you've brought someone with you. Most intriguing, if I do say so myself. You usually travel alone. It's not like you to take on partners, hmm. Candorus. They're getting soft. Watch yourself, Gallo. You may be the newest cat hound in the pack, but you aren't top dog yet. Enough. I won't have my top two men killing each other. That's not good business. I'm sure Candorus has an explanation <laughs> as to why he's not yeah. solo anymore. I this is a special well. case, Davak. I ran into someone the exchange might want to recruit. You may have heard something of their exploits already. Ah, yes. Now I recognize your companion. Mm. The rider who won the big swoop race. Very impressive, as was your display in the rather heated battle afterwards. Uh, hmm. okay. Ah. Suddenly, I don't like this. Hmm. I didn't know you were a swoop fan. A casual fan at best, but everyone on Taras follows the big season opener. But we have more important issues to discuss now. With the recommendation from Candorus and a thorough background check, you could become part of the exchange. Many would kill to prove themselves worthy of this honor. I'm really interested what's gonna happen if we flat out refuse at this point. Sorry, I'm not interested. Don't be so hasty. Our allies end up much better off than our enemies, as both Candrus and Callow Nord could surely tell you. The exchange has much to offer. Come with me. I will give you a tour of my operations. I'm certain hmm. you'll be most impressed. Ah, there she is. The Ebonhawk. My Ebon. pride and joy. The fastest ship in the Outer Rim. Note the state-of-the-art security system I've had installed to protect her. The shields are completely impregnable. Nobody can get past them without the codes to try and steal my baby. Unfortunately, the Sith military blockade has grounded my vessel. The Ebonhawk can outrun <laughs> any vessel in the galaxy. But even she isn't fast enough to avoid the auto targeting laser cannons of the orbiting Sith fleet. I am, of course, working on acquiring the Sith departure codes so that I may come and go as I please. Really? However, progress has been slow. But we should continue our tour. Little does he know. These'll be your accommodations. The slave quarters are just down the hall. If you need anything during your stay, food, a massage, feel free to call upon their services. If all goes well with your background check, you will be invited to join the exchange. I'd advise you to accept the offer when it comes, or suffer the dire consequences of refusal. Hmm. Am I a prisoner here? You will stay in these rooms as my guest for the next few days. I will not accept no for an answer. Feel free to visit the slave quarters at any time during your stay. I must warn you that if you are found anywhere outside the guest wing during your stay, or if you bother my other guests, my security forces will deal with you most harshly. Mm. I will return after the investigation into your background is complete. Until then, make yourself comfortable. Come, Callow. Let us leave our guests in peace. Okay, so let me... Okay, we're inside. Oh. Now all we have to do is figure out a way to get past the Ebon Hawk's security system, and we can get the rest of your group off this planet. No sense waiting around here, though. The sooner we get off Taurus, the better. Journal entry added. Uh, 
As promised, Kendra has got, in, uh, got you inside Davix's estate. The terrorist crime lord gave you a tour of his facilities, including the hangar where the Evan Hawk is stored. All you have to do now is find the codes to disable the Hawk security systems. Yes, so we do have the launch codes, but we don't have the codes for the Hawk security. Okay. Okay, so yeah. Kendra is leveled up. And before we do that, let me just take a look at something. Uh, so the quick save, yeah, there's the quick save, so we can recover with that quick save if we don't do one. So what I'm gonna do is do this. I'm gonna save over here, like that. Do we still have the quick save? We have the quick save, the auto save is separate, yes, and we do have our big load over here new cool that's three four five six yes okay so um i'm actually thinking that this is a good place to stop um wait a minute roy i'm gonna have to mow this over either we continue straight on from here or we could go back and try to and do some more free roaming before we got to the candor's conversation because i saved right after we got out of the or in the um, when we defeated the, the sentry droid, yes, the, the sentinel droid, yeah. Okay, so, yeah, I think, I think I'm gonna stop here. I'm getting a bit, I'm, I'm losing focus and I don't think I can, yeah, I, I do need to, to sleep a bit <laughs> before work tomorrow. So, Rory's calling, yeah, um, uh, thank you guys so much for being around here. Thank you for all the support. Thank you, Yonder J Bubbles. Bubbles, I'm sorry. Thank you, Sikis, for gifting us. Uh, thank you for the nice chats and the company. And it's been fun. It's. Uh, uh, we could go on for ages. <laughs>